It's 1am in the morning, and my day's just beginning. I'm just standing outside my local bakery here in West Sussex, hoping to enjoy a nice piping hot mince pie. But no, instead I'm standing here hungry and alienated by archaic systemic societal constructs. For too long now, nocturnalists like myself have been treated like second-class citizens. We don't enjoy or have access to the same basic necessities as diurnal members of our society have, like coffees from local cafes, clothing and retail options, technological advice from digital stores, and access to adequate lighting. I mean, seriously, how am I going to read Margaret Trotting's 1999 dissertation on the lack of diversity within 20th century anti-pastille cheese platters and her advocacy for more cheese options. Uh, basically, her research concludes that anti-pastille platters of the 20th century and the cheese within them are too white and inherently racist and in dire need of more cheeses of different colours and and textures. It's a very damning and insightful read and I definitely do recommend it, but I do digress. This is a message for you, Prime Minister Boris Johnson, to implement legislation that demands that all shops and businesses remain open until at least 4 a.m. so members of the nocturnal community can thrive and the diurnal majority will realise their oppressive ways. I simply demand that those within the UK Parliament introduce a bill to the House that penalises and punishes business owners and services who refuse to acknowledge the nocturnal amongst us that don't want to um, who don't ascribe to traditional daytime constructs. Whether those punishments be jail time or monetary penalties, you decide. How much is my life worth to the UK government? And now, for one more day, I will go hungry and perish into the darkness of the night.